This video is brought to you by Power Performance Products, where you can get $10 off your purchase of Body Storm and Body Effects. Hi guys, I'm Vini Magalhães. Uh, I'm back in the UFC as a light heavyweight contender. Not a contender like top 5, 10, 15, but you know, I'm there, so I'm a contender. Pei Zhao is coming off five straight victories, all stoppages in M1, before getting the opportunity to move back into the UFC. Like as soon as I signed, I think I signed on July 16th, and when it wasn't the, the 18th, like Joe, Joe came up with like with uh, that, that matchup for me, like fighting Eagle Per Cry. Uh, I loved the matchup, you know, like uh, it's not like Joe said, like pick a fight, then uh, I'll give whoever you want. He, he just told me, look, like you don't have many guys available right now, and these are the guys that are available. Are you cool with fighting any, any of these guys? And uh, Igor was one of them, and I was like, yeah, why not? I think Igor's a great matchup for me, like style-wise. I think I can like do really well against him. Uh, also, he's coming off three wins in the UFC, so like in my opinion, he's really well ranked at the, uh, at the moment. So beat him is gonna like you know rank me up like higher too, because like for now, I tell everybody like the light heavyweight division has like 30, 39 guys in like, my weight class now in the UFC. I rank myself as 39, so like I, I feel like if I beat Igor, I'm gonna go up there to like the 20s, you know, like that's where he's at now, so I think I take his spot. Showcasing the best jiu-jitsu in all of MMA, Vinny's stand-up has also been improving steadily at Extreme Couture. Uh, I've been fighting now for about like six, almost six years. Uh, dedicating myself into MMA, I would say the last like three, four years, so like, you know, I have to be like com like comfortable like on my feet. I have to be feeling pretty confident, like standing up by, by, by now. But uh, I'm still a jiu-jitsu guy, you know. Like even though like I'm, I don't mind being like trying to like train punches and stuff. That's that's not my game plan. Like and people will know that. I'm not gonna be lying. Yeah, I'm gonna try to like knock him out. That's you know if it happens, it happens. Like it happened like my two of my last three fights. But uh, I'm not gonna be focused on knocking him out. My focus is take him down and submit him there. If I can finish my my fit, cool. But if not, then I'm trying to take the fight to the ground. I always feel like that, that I have the advantage on the ground when it's when it comes to MMA. Like, uh, there are not many guys like in my weight class now, they're like high level grapplers. And that goes including the champion. Like, you know, even though he's really good, like he has really good ground, he's not like, he's not the highest caliber like as a grappler. So like, I feel like I do have the advantage of, like, on like a lot of guys in my division, but like, that doesn't mean that I'm gonna take him down and submit him right away. Sometimes I'm gonna have it to work. You know, there's no, there's nothing to be grabbing on. You're gonna be like sweaty. There is punches, so like, you know, it's not as easy as pure grappling. So, you know, even though I feel like I have the advantage, I can't finish a fight as quick as, you know, as a, the first few seconds on the ground. Sometimes it's not gonna work that way, and I know that. Vinny's son Vitor is now 20 months old and growing fast. I gotta just watch out for that guy. Like he's already like tried to punch me in the face. If I if I don't keep my hands up, he knocks me out. I'm not even kidding. Sometimes I just wake up and he's just like daddy, daddy, daddy. And if I just pretend that I'm serious sleep, he punched him in the face. So he just makes sure that I'm awake. So like you know, I gotta be careful for that little guy. He's gonna be a monster, man. Like I, I think he's gonna be like in a totally different level. Whatever he wants to do. Like if you, if you decide to be a fighter, it's gonna be like in a totally different level. And he's a southpaw too, so like I, you, people say they usually athletes that are like they're southpaw, they like tend to be like you know more talented. So like I believe that he's gonna be like ten times the athlete that I am. Come September 22nd, Vinny says he's gonna put on a show. I'll get a submission the first round. I will go even further. I, I think I'm gonna get a submission tonight because I don't think nobody's gonna on that car is gonna get a submission like as nice as mine. I'm gonna go for something something really fancy. Make sure to check out like you know my return to the UFC like uh, September 22nd. It's on the last fight on FX. So it's gonna be live. You guys don't miss that chance. Uh, I'm gonna do really well this time in the UFC. Hey there, we're the king of the cage, Green Girls. Thanks for watching MMA Interviews TV.